Welcome back to Amateur Game Review. Ashley here, who is attractive enough to be on voiceover, but not attractive enough to be on camera. Today, the guys are going to be reviewing MLB 22, The Show. Now, after watching them play this game for the last few days, I've decided that there are only two reasons you'd be watching this video right now. First of all, you don't know what MLB stands for or that it has anything to do with baseball. The second reason is autoplay, because there is no way in hell you can convince me that anyone actually likes or cares about this sport. Anyway, guess you should just roll that intro before I offend anyone else. All right, you already heard the intro, so you know today we are talking about MLB 21, the show, and whether or not 22. you should... What's that? 22. They made the same exact game. I can't use the same exact intro. Okay. And we're talking about MLB 22, the show, and that is basically my biggest gripe with this one. Yeah. Uh, you want to just wrap the video right there? Yeah. MLB 22 <laughs> review. If you liked last year's game, you will like this year's game. That's pretty much, yeah. I mean, they added a couple new things, but uh, same thing. So to show you guys what we're talking about, here's the intro for the Road to the Show game mode for MLB 22. What are you hearing? I'm checking the numbers, I'm talking to my sources, my scouts, and they're all telling me, hey, this could actually work. Most of us mere mortals, when we were that age, we were barely chewing gum and walking at the same time. Now here's last year's. What are you hearing? I'm checking the numbers, I'm talking to my sources, my scouts, and they're all telling me, hey, this could actually work. Most of us mere mortals, when we were that age, we were barely chewing gum and walking at the same time. Same thing. <laughs> they actually, they made the game worse because in last year you had spring training, you had the little, I mean, it's super, you only did it once, it was like a little mini game mm -hmm. where you hit, you pitch, whatever. They, even, they just took that out. Took it all the way out through, there was no spring training games, just took you straight to minor leagues, that was it. Does that make it a bad game? Because I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't like baseball. Like, it's my least favorite sport, to watch, to play, to anything. Yeah. I love playing MLB The Show. It's a good game. I love it. It is a fantastic game. Right, let's just get that out of the way. This is a fantastic game. My problem with this game is, it's the same fantastic game as last year, and the same fantastic game as the year before that, basically. It's like they nailed it with MLB The Show 11. Yeah. <laughs> and 10 years later, we're still nailing it. But, I mean, it's baseball. Where do you go from here? Because the actual sport hasn't changed since 1890. So how are they going to make a game different every year? Like, all my complaints with this game is that it's the same exact game as last year. I mean, they literally, we weren't kidding with that intro video. They used the same exact video for Road to the Show. That's lazy. That, that, that part's lazy. They should yes. have at least changed the video. I mean, Jesus. But the actual gameplay and stuff, it's the same game yeah. with the roster update. I mean, it doesn't even really look different. No. But I thought for like, well, last year it was like the PS5 just now is coming out. Mm -hmm. And with this one, they had a whole year to work on a game just for PS5. Yeah. I thought next gen was going to separate itself a little bit from last gen, and it didn't. That's really all I feel like I can complain about this game is that basically... They've done a bunch of lazy stuff. The graphics yeah. didn't improve for next gen like I thought that they should. Yeah. They used the same videos. It just feels like the same exact game. But the problem with reviewing this game is that the game, gameplay wise, this PlayStation game is better than the actual sport. Yeah. <laughs> they, they've, they've basically nailed it already. It's funner to, uh, Road to the Show, I can't stop playing it. So it's like I can't give this game a bad review because I honestly enjoy the hell out of the show. I don't know why you play on easy. <laughs> just let me enjoy myself I, uh, <laughs> baseball is the one sport I can't stand like ever since they got rid of the pitching machine when I was like 8 I, I just case, hated it yeah when I get a game I'm just about I don't expect Zach to play it like I, Zach might play it for 20 minutes but yeah I played it <laughs> no, I that's like not it. true okay so I get MLB the show and he's like yeah I played it last year too I said like, no you didn't because <laughs> I did <laughs> so he's telling me he's actually playing this game so I was kind of surprised like, he must really like this game he's playing it for more than 10 minutes. And I show up and I'm like, I see him, he's loaded his guy up, he's playing Road to the Show. And I was like, I see the first thing that threw me off was the camera view. So like, I play it like it's supposed to be played. I don't know what the hell you're doing. First thing he does is come in and change my camera view. You want to piss a man off, <laughs> change his camera view. So then I realized he's using directional hitting, which if you know anything about MLB The Show, it's not what you want to use. Oh, I'm sorry that I'm not on forums looking up how to cheat. For, uh, second thing he does after he changes my camera view is he goes in and he turns on the tutorials. And then midway through the tutorial, he turns off the tutorial. And then he hits a home run. And I was like, what the hell just happened? He's like, oh yeah, if you do that and you turn off the tutorial mid-pitch, they just throw it right down the middle. It's a glitch. He was complaining about not being able to hit a home run. I've played this game a ton. So, I mean, it's only been out for two days for us. Yeah. But 
in those two days, I've played it a ton. All I wanted to do was hit a home run, and now I have to live with the fact that my first home run was by Randy. I'm literally going to start my career over because I can't live with that. I do want to give you props, though, because you are playing with the far back camera view, where you see the batter, <laughs> you see the crowd, <laughs> you see the dugout. <laughs> I don't know how you see that pitch. <laughs> hey, I read them good. I thought that was going to start off with a compliment, but then you laugh at everything you said, so I feel like you're no, making fun of me. the fact that you can see that pitch from the camera being way back here. I got good glasses. <laughs> if you were to actually play on strike zone, where it's just a strike zone, yeah. you'd be able to see that ball. You'd be hitting home runs every other pitch. Is this a review, or are you just going to sit here and tell me what I'm doing wrong? Both. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's, do you have anything else to add about it? I mean... Gameplay. I mean, they added, like I said, there's new features as far. I know people got a CMB said 22 new features. There's no way they put 22 new things in this game. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. Maybe rookies. <laughs> first new features, the first guy drafted. <laughs> yeah, maybe. But, like, the pitch, the anchor for the PCI was new. Uh, the biggest one was the creative satum you can do. Yeah. You can actually play at nighttime now. <laughs> yeah. Before it was only daytime. So. Yeah. I feel like that was something that was just obvious. Like, they held it back last year just so they could release something this year. We've been saying for years that sports games are just roster updates, right? They really are. It, it sucks because I love sports. Before, there was an argument. Well, they added this, they added that, that, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Even though everyone knows it's just not roster update, they were able to defend themselves a little bit. Yeah. With this game, with the same video, they can't defend it no more. No. No, they can't. No, it's the same game. It's a roster update. You're yeah. right. 100%. So, let's, let's just wrap it up. Give this game a score. Ooh, it's hard. It is really hard because it's... You go first. Okay, I'll go first. It is a very good game. If you like baseball, you have to get this game. You have to. Yeah. Because they're going to stop updating the last year's <laughs> one and you're not going to have the up-to-date rosters. You're literally paying for up-to-date rosters. That's it. But at least with this game, the game is actually good. That's my biggest problem with Madden. I still buy Madden every year and it's terrible. And it just keeps being terrible on them, but it's just terrible roster updates. This is a really good, good, good baseball game that just suffers from the fact that they basically nailed it. But once you reach the ceiling of the world's most boring sport, you've got nowhere else to go with it, you yeah. know what I mean? So I give it a A-. minus. For a baseball game, I would give it an A, or I'd give it an A+, plus because it's the best baseball game out there. It is the best baseball game out there. But the fact that they reuse so much assets from the previous year, I'm docking it a whole letter and give it a B+. Plus. B+, plus. yeah. Okay, well, there you have it. A minus for me, B plus from Randy. <laughs> There's not a lot to say about this game. If you do have something to say about this game, let us know down in the comments below. Other than that, thank you for watching the video. We really appreciate your support. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you want to stay up to date with some of our other videos. This one was woo, average. Yeah. But you'll have that every once in a while. You gotta have some duds to really, really appreciate. You're not even looking. You know what? I'm just gonna keep rolling. It's fine. Worse, you didn't make it here because Randy can't even get through this video and he's sitting in behind the camera. <laughs> anyway, we really appreciate you and we will see you in the next video.